Though we have seen a lot of awesome and unique modern architectural design, architectural skills apparently have been an item for the past millenniums and some of them are still standing as a living proof so to speak. We bring you the 10 most magnificent architectural wonders of the ancient world. Number 10. Chandveri. Chandveri is a step well situated in the village of Abaneri in the Indian state of Rajasthan. It extends approximately 30 meters 100 feet into the ground, making it one of the deepest and largest step wells in India. Chandveri is a deep four-sided well with a large temple located in the back of the well. The basic architectural aspects of the monumental well consist of a long corridor of steps leading to five or six stories below ground level which can be seen at the site. Chandveri consists of 3,500 narrow steps over 13 stories. Number 9. Borobudur. Borobudur is a 9th century Mahayana Buddhist temple in Mage Lang Regency, not far from the town of Munt Ilan, in central Java, Indonesia. It is the world's largest Buddhist temple. The temple consists of 9 stacked platforms, 6 square and 3 circular, topped by a central dome. It is decorated with 2,672 relief panels and originally 504 Buddha statues. The central dome is surrounded by 72 Buddha statues, each seated inside a perforated stupa. Built in the 9th century during the reign of the Salendra dynasty, the temple design follows Javanese Buddhist architecture, which blends the Indonesian indigenous tradition of ancestor worship and the Buddhist concept of attaining nirvana. The temple demonstrates the influences of Gupta art that reflects India's influence on the region, yet there are enough indigenous scenes and elements incorporated to make Borobudur uniquely Indonesian. Number 8. Stonehenge. Stonehenge is a prehistoric monument on Salisbury Plain in Wiltshire, England, 2 miles, 3 kilometers, west of Amesbury. It consists of an outer ring of vertical sarsen standing stones, each around 13 feet, 4 meter, high, 7 feet, 2.1 meter, wide, and weighing around 25 tons, topped by connecting horizontal lintel stones. Inside is a ring of smaller blue stones. Inside these are freestanding trilithons, two bulkier vertical sarsens joined by one lintel. The whole monument, now ruinous, is aligned towards the sunrise on the summer solstice. Archaeologists believe that Stonehenge was constructed from 3000 BC to 2000 BC. The surrounding circular earth bank and ditch, which constitute the earliest phase of the monument, have been dated to about 3100 BC. Number 7. Palace of Alhambra. Truly should be among the architectural wonders of the ancient world, Alhambra not only features a great structure from the outside, it even boasts of an awesome interior design. The Alhambra is a palace and fortress complex located in Granada, Andalusia, Spain. It is one of the most famous monuments of Islamic architecture and one of the best preserved palaces of the historic Islamic world, in addition to containing notable examples of Spanish Renaissance architecture. The Alhambra was one of the first Islamic monuments to become the object of modern scientific study and has been the subject of numerous restorations since the 19th century. It is now one of Spain's major tourist attractions and a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Number 6. Sultan Ahmed Mosque. The Blue Mosque in Istanbul, also known by its official name, the Sultan Ahmed Mosque, is an Ottoman era historical imperial mosque located in Istanbul, Turkey. A functioning mosque, it also attracts large numbers of tourist visitors. It was constructed between 1609 and 1616 during the rule of Ahmed I. Its kulai contains Ahmed's tomb, a madrasa, and a hospice. Hand-painted blue tiles adorn the mosque's interior walls. The Blue Mosque was included in the UNESCO World Heritage Site list in 1985 under the name of Historic Areas of Istanbul. Number 5. Mausoleum of Taj Mahal. The Taj Mahal is an Islamic ivory-white marble mausoleum on the right bank of the river Yamuna in the Indian city of Agra. It was commissioned in 1632 by the Mughal Emperor Shah Jahan to house the tomb of his favorite wife, Mumtaz Mahal, it also houses the tomb of Shah Jahan himself. The tomb is the centerpiece of a 17-hectare, 42-acre, complex, which includes a mosque and a guest house, and is set in formal gardens bounded on three sides by a crenellated wall. The Taj Mahal was designated as a UNESCO World Heritage Site in 1983 for being the jewel of Muslim art in India and one of the universally admired masterpieces of the world's heritage. It is regarded by many as the best example of Mughal architecture and a symbol of India's rich history. The Taj Mahal attracts more than 6 million visitors a year.
And in 2007, it was declared a winner of the new Seven Wonders of the World, 2000-2007, initiative. Number 4. The Tower of Pisa. The Leaning Tower of Pisa, or simply, the Tower of Pisa, is the Campanile, or freestanding bell tower, of Pisa Cathedral. It is known for its nearly 4 degree lean, the result of an unstable foundation. The tower is one of three structures in the Pisa's Cathedral Square, Piazza del Duomo, which includes the cathedral and Pisa Baptist Istri. The tower began to lean during construction in the 12th century, due to soft ground which could not properly support the structure's weight. It worsened through the completion of construction in the 14th century. By 1990, the tilt had reached 5.5 degrees. The structure was stabilized by remedial work between 1993 and 2001, which reduced the tilt to 3.97 degrees. Number 3. Great Pyramid of Giza. The Great Pyramid of Giza is the largest Egyptian pyramid in the tomb of 4th dynasty Pharaoh Khufu. Built in the 26th century BC during a period of around 27 years MIT is the oldest of the seven wonders of the ancient world, and the only one to remain largely intact. As part of the Giza pyramid complex, it borders present-day Giza and Greater Cairo, Egypt. Initially standing at 146.6 meters, 481 feet, the Great Pyramid was the tallest man-made structure in the world for more than 3,800 years. Over time, most of the smooth white limestone casing was removed, which lowered the pyramid's height to the present 138.5 meters, 454.4 feet. What is seen today is the underlying core structure. The base was measured to be about 230.3 meters, 755.6 feet, square, giving a volume of roughly 2.6 million cubic meters, 92 million cubic feet, which includes an internal hillock. It is still a majestic wonder how humans are able to arrange these huge rocks that weigh several tons the way they did. The Great Pyramid of Egypt is a complex of several pyramids, these are Menkor, Mikorinos, Khafra, Chepfrin and Chufo Cheops respectively. Number 2. Megalithic Temples of Malta. The megalithic temples of Malta are several prehistoric temples, some of which are UNESCO World Heritage Sites, built during three distinct periods approximately between 3600 BC and 2500 BC on the island country of Malta. They had been claimed as the oldest freestanding structures on Earth until the discovery of Gobi Kliti. Archaeologists believe that these megalithic complexes are the result of local innovations in a process of cultural evolution. This led to the building of several temples of the Gontija phase, 3600 to 3000 BC, culminating in the large Tarxian temple complex, which remained in use until 2500 BC. After this date, the temple building culture disappeared. The Gontija temples were listed as a UNESCO World Heritage Site in 1980. In 1992, the UNESCO committee further extended the existing listing to include five other megalithic temple sites. These are Hagerkim, in Krendi, Najdra, in Krendi, Tahagrat temples, in Gart, Skorba temples, in Zibig, and Tarxian temples, in Tarxian. Nowadays, the sites are managed by Heritage Malta, while ownership of the surrounding lands varies from site to site. Number 1. Great Wall of China. The Great Wall of China, is a series of fortifications that were built across the historical northern borders of ancient Chinese states and Imperial China as protection against various nomadic groups from the Eurasian steppe. Several walls were built from as early as the 7th century BC, with selective stretches later joined together by Qin Shi Huang, 220-206 BC, the first emperor of China. Little of the Qin wall remains. Later on, many successive dynasties built and maintained multiple stretches of border walls. The best known sections of the wall were built by the Ming Dynasty, 1368-1644. Apart from defense, other purposes of the Great Wall have included border controls, allowing the imposition of duties on goods transported along the Silk Road, regulation, or encouragement of trade and the control of immigration and emigration. Furthermore, the defensive characteristics of the Great Wall were enhanced by the construction of watchtowers, troop barracks, garrison stations, signaling capabilities through the means of smoke or fire, and the fact that the path of the Great Wall also served as a transportation corridor. Today, the defensive system of the Great Wall is generally recognized as one of the most impressive architectural feats in history. 
That's the list of 10 most amazing architectural wonders in the ancient world, there are many other great ancient architecture in this world. But we have summarized them into 10 of the best. Some of them are included in the list of UNESCO World Heritage Sites. If you like this video, check out our other clips on this channel, be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest video. Thank you for watching.